Hello everybody, I am Elio, and let us continue playing Earthbound Blind. So, last time we beat a couple of bosses that I assume were Belgian minions, and we acquired this ghost, which is just hovering around us. Though, I haven't seen it doing anything in battle yet, or at least I haven't noticed it do anything, so it's just a minor visual annoyance right now. And we got here to this peaceful rest valley type dungeon, I guess. And we will continue on to goodness knows where. I don't even know where we're going right now, so... What we got here is a recolor of a zombie, recolor of antoids, and a frog. Okay. Quite a lot of enemies, so I'll just rock and beta them all. And fire the front row with Paula, and spy on that frog. See what I can learn about that. Tiny little ghost. Oh, so that thing that's hovering around Ness actually does something. So it didn't appear to be doing too much damage, so... Yeah. Something is that big of an annoyance, and that frog just died instantly. That's helpful. Farm zombie. Okay, just shift targets to the... Uh, to spy on the farm zombie, I guess. Rumble to fire and flash. Alright, All right, pull it. And Paula's bash actually does quite a lot of damage to that zombie, considering her offensive skills aren't that great when bashing. And everyone gets a level up, lovely. 9 HP for Jeff. That's kind of nice. And open a present. Ness has a. Ness gets the bomb inside, alright. Continue on. Wow. No enemies in my way at all. This is kind of unusual. And give me another present, why don't you? Protein drink inside. Ness takes it. Hmm. Let's find out what that does. I see protein, I think, increases attack permanently. Thanks, Pokemon. Blast of nourishment when you fatigue. Drink this and recover 80 HP. Alright, that's alright then. Noted. Ooh, butterfly. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Alright then. Yeah, Ness is going to need that to recover the PP he just used. Oh, speaking of which, I healed people off screen. Um, using kind of a farming method with butterflies. Hello, crocodile! You were <laughs> ran the risk of running right into Jeff's back there, so... Might as well face your head on. Plain crocodile. Alright then. Hmm. Considering how big it was on the field, I assume it'll have a lot of HP and a lot of offense, so... I'll go with rocking with Ness. Go with fire with poor. No, there's just one enemy, so I think I'll save the PP and use freeze and have Jeff spy to see what I can learn about it. Oh, you ghost, you do so little damage. It's like you barely exist. Alright, freeze and. Wow! That is quite a lot of damage! I guess it's weak to it. Defense 40, defense 55, and yes, vulnerable to freeze. And I don't imagine it has too much HP, so. I'll just have a bash of freeze and a shoot, I think. Oh, Jeff's body solidified. So the ghost can do that as well. That That's actually kind of more annoying. I should probably get rid of that ghost then. As soon as possible. And 643 experience. But that's some friends, sorry. Oh, dead end here. Alright then. And. Oh, the ghost despawned. The zombie, rather. Oh, but then I just get. Bunch of enemies in return. Lovely. The zombie laughed at me. I can honestly say I have never heard of a zombie laughing in media. <laughs> so many first times with this game. Okay. Caves. Lovely. Hmm. Two way split. And a cockroach? Alright then. Let's fight it then. Fight a roach. I don't imagine it's too powerful, so. Have this bash. Have a freeze and have Jeff spy it. Let's see if we can learn anything. Freeze the roach. Wow, a lot of damage again. And we get to defeat it before Jeff can even spy on it. Lovely. And I just noticed how low Paula's and Jeff's HP is. I should probably heal that right now. Alright, PSI. Life up on Paula and Jeff. Because you just never know with Jeff and Paul being so leveled and low leveled and well at least <laughs> compared to Ness and 
all the more powerful enemies we've been seeing recently. Bottle Rocket! Ness takes it. Can I give that to Jeff? Nope. Everybody's inventory is full. Lovely. Should probably find a shop soon and sell stuff. Or find a phone and store stuff. That's probably the better option. Where's the music in here? Kind of quaint and calm. And it's kind of like steel drums or something. It's kind of like aluminium cans clacking against each other, sort of. And now the music's turned goofy. And there's a lot of yellow grass around. Oh! Hi, it's Mr. Sen! Hello! Refuel Groove! Hi ho, me, Mr. Sutton! This plus all our F Sutton. All our Mr. Sutton. Oh really? Oh, Mr. Sutton up there too. It's like a it's like a village of Mr. Sens. That's cool. I like it. Hello, sir. Do you want slumber? Yes I do. Cause oh Ah, oh, these things are so charming. So well heal from the looks of it. And pick up the receiver. Yeah, while I'm here, I think I'll call Dad, actually. Ooh, deposited over 5000 to our bank account. Taking away what you've spent, now... Got around 4000 in the bank, alright then. Oh, we got told how much experience we've got to our next level of. That's good. I guess, though, I guess we can, we can just check that in the status menu, but whatever. Click, beep, beep, beep. Alright then. Let's get out of here. Does this pond do anything? Nope, it's just here. What's in this house? <laughs> Another Mr. Satin, who could have guessed, I know. No problem here, There's, you just got plants in your room, okay, and you're just hiding in a trash can. I'm Dr. Satin, zoom, and I can repair your bottle. Boing! Do you want me to operate on you? Ding! Yes. Does that get rid of that ghost? You are all fixed up. Good boing! It does get rid of the ghost, lovely! Thank you so much, Dr. San. Once upon a time, we were many, many. Every day, slowly, we are less, less. Hmm? Boing! Huh. Are they going extinct or something? Huh. Respirator inside, but I have too much stuff! Ah. Anything in this side of this cave here? Trash bins. Oh, and they're not enemy ones. <laughs> Thank goodness. Sudden guts pal. I have too much stuff! Ah! Should probably get rid of stuff. I mean, hopefully there's a shop here in Satin Village. That would be nice. I'll give you a special thing. Not now. Zoom. Oh. Inventory! What have we got here that I could use? Skip sandwich? <laughs> I guess if it clears an inventory spot. Really look like soon. I give you a special thing. Not now. Oh. I guess it doesn't matter for the inventory for what he's gonna give me. Ah oh, well. Oh. <laughs> Just on a random alcove here. Whatever. <laughs> Seems kind of pointless if you ask me. Scary, scary guy, boing. Grapefruit falls. Scary, sick rifle. Going. La la la. Ding. Scary. Waterfalls, huh? Base secret. Base behind Grateful Falls. Password? I tell. Belchman, say. Say password. Then stand still. Wait for three minutes. I don't actually have to wait for three minutes, do I? <laughs> uh, probably will have to. Uh, secret herb. For how many dollars? And you... You have... Uh, 1,780? I can just barely read that number. We trade Horn of Life. Horn of Life, huh? Hmm. Sounds like it'd be a revival item, if you ask me. So, what's in this house? Well, Mr. Sands, of course. Now, uh, phone across the way? Why is it so much further away? That's weird. What's this thing here? Automatic teller machine. Oh, it's an ATM, so I can withdraw stuff. We'll draw money, okay. Hi, 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 look combined. You can sell too. Oh, a store, good. What are we buying? It's spray stag beetle. Stag beetle? What? What use could that have? Peanut cheese bar. Healing item, I guess? I don't know how much it would heal for. Might even restore SPP, uh, rather. 
Horn of Life. Oh, this is what we were talking about before. And Secret Herb, which can be sold, uh, bought for 380. But I imagine that's like the refreshing herb, only it restores more stuff or heals more ailments. So I don't imagine it being that much worth it. I have a picture postcard. Okay. No, no, I don't want it. Pressing the A button instead of the B button. Huh. <sighs> so, what's this guy's deal? Oh, buying more stuff. What can I buy from him? Oh, weapons and equipment and stuff. Okay. Bionic slingshot. Again, the slingshots, I imagine them being less accurate, so I won't bother buying them. And great charm. Ooh. Defense boost for Paula and Jeff. Silver bracelet for Miss Paula and ribbon ribbon for Paula. Okay, so I've got plenty of monies to get out of the ATM. Because I want to buy all this stuff. Oh! It just hit me that I have no space for any of it! Alright. 2000 in your. Yeah, 2004. Good year, that. Very good year. One of my favorites. <laughs> Something like NCS here. Okay. Oh. Uh, boy. You know what? I'll do all this selling and sorting out off screen because otherwise you get very bored of it, I'm sure. Okay, I've sold everything I want to, I think. I just want to sort out the inventory a little bit. I want Jeff to have more space, so I'll give Ness the jar of fly honey. If, if I even need that anymore. I wonder if I didn't have that, would I have had to fought, fight the slime that I screwed up on? Yeah. Too late to put to that now, I guess. Uh, pack of bubblegum? I don't think we need that anymore, I can probably store that. As with the bad key machine, I guess? I don't know, maybe worth keeping around. I guess it might be useful for unlocking stuff later. Uh, have him keep up Blossom just in case he needs to heal someone for a turn. And otherwise, I think I'm- oh! Give Jeff the bottle rocket. Because I think he might be the only one that can use the bottle rocket, I think. I seem to recall uh, reading the help and, and reading something like that. Okay, on to buying. Get the red ribbon for Paula. Five more defense for her, lovely. Oh, and sell the old ribbon she had. Alright then. And, oh, no, I said I don't want to buy the slingshot. No, I'm not window shopping, don't worry. <laughs> okay, get silver bracelet. Or <laughs> carry this burden. Make it sound so painful or something. Whatever. And sell the old charm he had. And buy a silver bracelet for Polar as well. And yeah, sell the copper bracelet she had as well. Alright, and was there more equipment? Yeah, there was the great charm. Get those for Polar and Jeff. Pick up here. Oh! One defense. That's less than desirable. And... By great charm for Jeff. I um, imagine this being... Yeah, it's def one defense for Jeff as well. I feel a little ripped off. Okay, anything else I might be interested in? Nope, not really. Okay then. Hi, hi. I just want to check this guy. In case there's anything I want to buy from him as well. Picture postcard, secret herb, horn of life. I might want to buy that horn of life, actually. Hmm. No, it's. I don't think I have that much money in the ATM left. In my account left, so. I'll hold off on it for now. Let's head over here. Ooh, there's hot springs. Can I get up there? Help the. Oh. <laughs> These ladders don't go all the way up. That's quite unfortunate. Okay. Lots of friends clicking behind falls. Why? Why? Boing! Yeah, so that, I guess that's why the population is dwindling. Because all the Mr. Satins are being taken behind those grapefruit falls, did they call it before? Huh. Through the zombie fall, I saw a big bad stink behind falls. Zoom! Bad stink behind the falls. Is that where Belch is hidden? That would be cool. Well, something. <laughs> I don't know whether it'd be cool or not. Anyway, um, hmm. And finally find Belch at last. That would be something. 
I think I can, yeah, I will buy that, oh, wait, I need the money for it first. I will buy that horn of life, if only to see what it does. Okay, it was around 1,800, wasn't it? So... Oh, no! I pressed the B button by accident! Jeez. No! Stop skipping through the menus, and actually do what you're supposed to do. Okay. 1,400, and actually withdraw it this time. Okay. And then... Buy the... No, not the secret herb! I already said I don't want to buy that! Ah. Patience. It is a virtue. Who will carry it? Yeah, Paula's got the most space right now. I guess she can take it. And no, I don't need anything else. Alright then. And I'm back then. All these Mr. Sands around here. They really are kind of cute. Alright. Is there one of the trash bins in here? Yeah. I can open them and see what's in them. It's here. Sudden good spill. Ness takes it. What does that do? Oh. Goods. Sudden good spill. Guts your... doubles your guts during battle. Ooh. After the battle, guts return to normal. Gone after one use. So I guess that would be good for bosses then. Keep that around. A protractor inside. Lovely. More useless items. Let's see here. Broken spray can. More stuff that Jeff can repair. I should probably find out how you make those uh, get that stuff repaired more often, more quickly, because it can take up a lot of inventory space otherwise. And what is it? I got rust promoter. Let's have a look. Quickly rust metallic enemies during battle. All right. For use on robots. Alrighty then. Keep that in mind. Got a lot of useless items, I think I'll go and check the phone now. Oh, no! I want to talk to Dad. I want to call it the Escargo Express. So I can deposit some of these items I have. Pick up. So I know someone over to pick it up. Alright. Head on out. And wait for the sudden surprise. It's crazy how this guy can just pop up anywhere, no matter where you are, and... Oh! <laughs> coming from the north, eh? Never quite expect him. Alright. What to store? Well, for starters, I can store these protractors, and uh, the protractor and ruler that Jeff has, because they seem to be plugging up a lot of inventory space that doesn't, <laughs> that I could really use, and it's kind of wasted on them. Okay, so... Now I've got some st stuff stored, now what? Not entirely sure what I'm meant to do. Gather clues, let's see. Grapefruit Falls... And... Special thing. Yeah, no, no, no. I know you're not gonna give me that now. Behind Grapefruit Falls, password... Save password and stand still, wait for three minutes. Grapefruit Falls... Hmm... Oh! Oh, I remember! I remember seeing... I didn't think much of it at the time, but... At that dead end, there were... There was a waterfall. There. And I guess the stuff I was supposed to do there? The stuff behind the waterfall? Hmm. Well, we've been going on for long enough, I think, right now, so... I think I'll call it here. So, I thank you all for watching, and next time, we shall head to the waterfall and head behind it, I guess, and we'll, we'll see what we can do from there. So, I thank you all for watching, and I shall see you all then.